Welcome back one more time to Boat Week on the RC Sailors. You'll notice that I've got a pretty good sized boat here in front of me. I mean, that is gonna be two and a half, three feet long or so, right? Mm -hmm. That's a really big boat. Uh, we don't tend to see them this size, especially at this price. Well, you'll notice once you get a little bit closer, as cool as this looks, you know, we're looking at some things like brushed motor. Body clips, body that's clips, a first. The first on a boat. <laughs> A lot of empty space inside this boat. It's actually got two brushed motors and a tiny, tiny battery. So although this says high speed boat, there's think, no way. I think what we're looking at is like a really large, cool looking boat. It's going to be fairly slow, fun for the kiddos or the kiddos at heart. What we're going to do though is test this because compared to everything that we've seen on the channel so far this week, it stands well. I mean, we've had a couple funny things and one really good boat actually so far. We're gonna see how this stacks up compared to the others and just have a good time driving some RC boats at the lake this week. At the end of the week, we'll let you guys know what my favorite and what Abby's favorite boats were. And uh, we're, we're just having fun. So we're gonna power this on and put it in the water. Transmitter's on, then I hit the on off button on the boat. There we go, there we go. Two props in the back? Two props. What about the rudder? What's going I'm on with that? I'm not seeing any rudder oh, movement at is all. Is it connected? This, this feels broken, actually. Oh my gosh. But what could be, what this could be is, ah, uh, yeah. Okay, so the rudder is gonna hold it straight as we click it into place. And then I'm assuming to steer, as long as that works, we'll have one motor spin and the other is off to make it turn. So the rudder is mainly for looks and to kind of hold it straight. Yeah, so if we notice when it's driving straight out on the water, if it's veering off in one direction, we can drive it back and then click it over one or two clicks and see if that helps to hold it straight. We're just gonna put it vertical and hope that does the job. This is like the biggest, cheapest feeling boat we've ever had on the channel. Let's find out how this goes. This is gonna be crazy. Does it work? Yeah, it worked out of the water. I know, I just was I just asking if it push. worked in the water. Okay, not bad for the speed, and yeah, I was right. So, although the radio wheel felt cheap, it does it does actually work. So it's one rudder, or one motor, and one prop is just spinning while the other spins slower to help so yeah, it turn. It gets louder when both are going, right? Yeah, and it does have, surprisingly, proportional throttle, so... It's so nice loud. and slow, and then there's full throttle. Do a speed pass so horizontal like that's baby. I'll try. <laughs> I do need to trim it up with the manual trim on there. This is one of the slower boats we've ever had on the channel. Of this size, especially. But for this week, one of the fastest boats. <laughs> I know I have a strong there's there's full throttle, not touching anything. All right, so if you've never had a boat before and you picked this up at a yard sale or you just wanted to bring something out for the kids maybe, this would be okay. But we've seen a lot more hobby grade boats than this through the years on our channel. And uh, yeah, this, is, this is it, what you see guys. This is <laughs> as good as it gets. Guys, I, this feels like a milk carton, just so you know. Yeah, I, I cannot believe. It's cheap. Oh my gosh. So something sounds really grindy. <laughs> Let's bring it in if it'll even come in. We may have just lost one of our props or possibly both. It does feel like we lost the prop. I was just getting I ready to pass. I think you lost the left one. I think you saw right. I was getting ready to pass the controls to you, Abby. And of by the course way, this, you were. this has no reverse on it. Yeah, you're right. We, we've lost one side. So, <laughs> hey, at least we have, what's it called, redundancy? Yeah, we have redundancy going on here. You know, you know, when, when one fails, you have the other to save you. Well, <laughs> is it saving you when this is, this is, this is it? I don't know if we can get this back. I'm stuck going in circles. Oh, we're going to have to get the Titanic. That or I'm going to let the wind bring it in. And actually, look at this. I'm not touching it. And it was giving some throttle. Here we go. Well, this Let's should, see. we need to so far rename this to like not so good boat week. <laughs> Well, there's been one or two that have been pretty cool. Uh, the Titanic, depending on how you look at it, and then the little boat, depending on we where might, you're gonna drive we it. We might be pulling the Titanic out again. I'm not doing this for fun. This is me trying to get the boat back into shore here. Because when I turn right, it just doesn't go, and then when I go in reverse, I got nothing. There's no trim on here. 
That's, I'm not touching anything and it's doing that now. <laughs> <laughs> this is, this is like the worst He's not doing on anything. the channel ever, Abby. I'm not even doing that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have to go for a swim, oh, aren't I? Man. There's a snake. You here. can't recover that with the Titanic. The Titanic no. can't keep up with. No, the Titanic is too slow. Okay, come on, little guy. Can I see? Even when I steer, I can't. I just wanted to get. There we go. When I do that, I'm gonna get it. Okay, so you're, here. you're holding left. Yeah, so I'm letting it go left, and then I hold right when it's on oh, its straight path. And then I let the... Oh, the stick! I know. Okay, we got it. So when I go... When it goes straight here... I'm gonna be, and I hold it. And I let its speed get it in. One more loop, Abby. One more loop. We're gonna all look at the damages this is together. crazy. And I hold it straight. You got and then it. And I let it come in. You got it. And I let... Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. It's not stopping. Turn it off. Ooh. Thank goodness it's an on-off switch. Oh, wow. my wow. Lanta. Wow. That so, was just so bad. We have something slipping here. Yeah, Let's so we didn't inside. lose a prop. No, we didn't. I thought we did, So did, did we burn up a motor? I think they possibly. They look so bad. I think it feels very hot in here, Abby. Wow. It's always stinking strong, too. We've definitely Burned fried something. And that just tells you really wow. poor quality control. For sure, one of these motors is fried. No water got in you here. You see that like mark in there? It is on this just, side? Yeah, oh yeah, look at that. I, I, I don't know, I don't know what's going on exactly, but it's smelling strong and there's no water in there. So I think it's just a poor quality <laughs> control on the motor. That is what we call two thumbs down hard pass. Wow, 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 wow. What do you guys think of boat week so far? <laughs> so this is record setting worst boat week ever on the RC Sailors so far. We've had a couple good ones. That guy just wants to see a good boat. <laughs> no, oh, well, this has been horrible. <laughs> I'm really interested to see how tomorrow's boat does, okay? It's not gonna be fast, but it's got a lot of attention to detail. And I'm looking forward to that because I haven't had anything quite like it ever on the channel before. As cool as this looks, if you were browsing the internet and you saw a picture of this and you're like, whoa, look at that price. I gotta have that boat. It does look pretty cool at a glance. Like if you were just browsing and you click. Yeah, it looks good. Person, that's why like, we have it. That's right. So <laughs> that's, that's a pass. And that's hopefully where you guys find the value in our channel. That is crazy, crazy bad. I don't know what we're gonna do with this. Hopefully. I don't know. That's sell for five dollars, somebody. <laughs> I mean, it's a good swimming pool pusher. You just yeah, no power, no battery. Yeah, you just play with it in the pool. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah, like a rubber ducky. I'd take the motors out just so you don't get like rust. Sure. Or, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> if for some crazy reason you're interested, we'll have this link in the description box below. Maybe you just want to know the price. Maybe I don't know. You just want to see it for yourself because this is actually available for sale. We've had really good things on that website. We've had some bad things there too. And for the good things, and just getting out here and having a good time. Sunshine. Beautiful day at the lake. For that, I thank God. I'm so happy. Abby and I are just having a good day together, even though we have some pretty crappy boats here in our hands. Uh, it's still fun. This, we're still having a good time. And to fuel that fun, for everybody watching, the reason this content is 100% free for everyone in the world to watch if they so choose is because of our patrons. Everyone that supports us from a dollar or more, you just mean the world to us. We couldn't do this without you. Thank you guys so much. You should be all getting some stickers right about now. Abby still has to work. I mean, I think about half of the people are getting their stickers right around now. We're still working on it. We're still getting some stickers out. It's like, just me, guys. Yeah, it's Abby does all of it. the patron stickers completely on her By own, hand. So. Well, believe it or not, we have had some really good bunch of boats on the channel. One of those will be popping up right about now. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you there. Bye.